What's up everybody? Welcome back to A Beer Day with TK. Today is Halloween, so I decided to get in the spirit and break out my old monk uh, costume here. I used this in law school about 10 years ago, and I still had it in the garage, so I figured I'd break it out. It kind of goes with the, some of the beer motifs. We're doing these German 12 beers of Christmas. And if I wear this outfit, I look like maybe I could be a monk on the front of one of these German Helles Lagers or something, right? So the beer we have today is a Helles Lager, and this is from the C. Whitman Brewery. So it looks like this is uh, Whitman or Hell. Ooh, Hell, see, there you go, spooky. Um, they're from Landschut, Bavaria, Germany. So this is the Browery C. Whitman. Uh, this beer comes in at 5.1% ABV. Uh, I went to the, the website, and it was kind of interesting. I think this is the first of these German breweries that I've been to where the website was actually in English. I didn't have to use Google Translate to kind of butcher half of the stuff on the site. Um, they showed you some of the beers they had. So they had some Rattlers, a Zwickel, Pils, Box. They had a, a wide range of German beers. They all look pretty good. I can't say that I've had any of them before. Um, so I'd be interested to check out some of their other beers if, if possible. Um, they also had a link talking about events that they have at the brewery. It looks like they host all kinds of events normally, um, but because of COVID, most of the stuff has been shut down, which is unfortunate. So let's check this beer out today. This is uh, Whitman. It says Landschutter Special Latin Browery. Um, I looked on Untapped and it says, the Whitman Orhel pours with a golden yellow color and has a fine poured stable head. The aroma is malty, but otherwise quite neutral. In the first sip, you can taste light malt notes the finish is rather spicy. The carbonation is perfectly done and gives this beer an incomparable drinkability. So I guess that's the style guide for the for this beer here. Let's see if it if it lives up to those uh, to that uh, description. So using the black cloister glass again. Stick with the the monk motif, right? Untap gives us a three two five. Beer Advocate a three four five. As for the number grade, it came in at a 79 as an okay. It smells a bit sweet. There's the Whitman or Hell. As you can see, it looks pretty heavily carbonated. Fair amount of uh, bubbles going through here. Foam looks nice, nice, you know, solid bit of nice white head. Smell, it's kind of biscuity, but you do definitely pick up a sweetness to it as well. Mm. Not bad. Let's give it a shot. The initial taste is a little funky, to be honest. Um, then I get like a, a biscuity kind of thing, like a, a malty taste. And then at the end, you kind of get a, a light hop. So I don't think it's a heavy hops. It's kind of like sweet and strange, uh, the initial taste, though. Yeah, it's a little bit different. Um, definitely not as hoppy as some of the others, not as malty either. You kind of get a an odd sweetness. Almost tastes like, like a corn sweetness, like you get with uh, some of the adjunct type beers. It's a bit odd. It's not bad, it's just a, a different type of taste. Yeah. Up front, kind of get the weird sweetness, maltiness. At the end, you get a bit of the spicy hops. I wouldn't say you get a ton of hops. I wouldn't say it's overly spicy, but you do pick up a little bit of, the, I guess, hops for flavoring purposes at the end there. So, Whitman or Hell, on Halloween, you get a thumbs up. I would try another one of these. Um, I don't think it's the best beer in this box that I've had by far, but I think that it's it's pretty solid. It's drinkable. You could drink a few of these and it wouldn't be a problem. So thumbs up for Whitman. If you liked the video, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that like button. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please hit subscribe. If you have any friends or family that would be interested, please hit share. If you guys had this before, let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think about it. So everybody have a safe Halloween. Enjoy some beers. And until next time, cheers.